The Kata of Pra Garuda, the King of Birds. In Hinduism, Garuda, is a divine eagle-like sun bird and the king of birds. A Garutman is mentioned in the Rigveda, who is described as celestial deva with wings. The Shatapatha Brahmana embedded inside the Yajurveda text says Garuda is the personification of courage. In the Mahabharata, Garutman is stated to be the same as Garuda, citation needed, then described as the fast one, who can shapeshift into any form and enter anywhere. He is a powerful creature in the epics whose wing flapping can stop the spinning of heaven, earth, and hell. The Hindu texts on Garuda iconography vary in their details. If in the bird form, he is eagle-like, typically with the wings slightly open as if ready and willing to fly wherever he needs to. In part human form, he may have an eagle-like nose, beak, or legs, and his eyes are open and big, his body is the color of emerald, and his wings are golden yellow. He may be shown with either two or four hands. Garuda is described to be the vehicle mount of the Hindu god Vishnu, and typically they are shown together. Garuda is described as the king of birds and a kite-like figure. He is shown either in zoomorphic form, giant bird with partially open wings or an anthropomorphic form, man with wings and some bird features. Garuda is generally a protector with the power to swiftly go anywhere, ever watchful, and an enemy of the serpent. He is also known as Turkshaya and Vinaya. Garuda is a part of state symbol in India, Myanmar, Thailand, Cambodia, and Indonesia. Before chanting to any Thai Buddhist statue or amulet, you should always pay respect to recite the mantra of Namo Tassa three times in the beginning before chanting the particular kata. Namo Tassa Pakawato Arahato Sama Samputasa Namo Tassa Pakawato Arahato Sama Samputasa Namo Tassa Pakawato Arahato Sama Samputasa This Pragarudakata chanting is recorded and repeated three times. You may recite it for more, according to your faith. พระรูปิจกิติมันตังมะอุโอมพยาครุฑรุดรุดแล้วรวยณได้เงินณได้ทองณได้ทรงณมั่นคงณเจริญณมั่นคงณได้ทรงณเมตตาอิติปิโสภ
อิติคงเนื้ออิติคงหนังพยาครุจยันติอภิปูชยามิพยาครุจจะผุดมนุษย์จะเกิดพุทธังแคลคราดธรรมังแคลคราดสังคังแคลคราดองค์พระพุทธเจ้าย่างบาทณปัจจโยโหนตุ The recitation of Garuda Kata confers multifold blessings on the reciter and fulfills hearty wishes of all kinds. If one chants the Kata with devotion daily, he will start noticing changes in his life. The devotee gets rid of all the enemies and gets increased confidence and power. His fears and anxiety disappear as he practices the powerful Garuda Kata. Chant the Kata at any time and any day. The best time to practice is early morning. And anybody can chant the kata without any restriction of age and gender. You can use a picture of Lord Garuda or the yantra to chant the kata. Lord Garuda can be worshipped for increasing confidence and courage and removing all kinds of fears.